home based business, baking business. I decided whenever you kids were very little that I needed to have some kind of income because I was working full time in Pittsburgh and my job got eliminated when National City bought out Integra Bank. I was eight months pregnant with you and I had Brian who was two years old and I needed some income. So I decided if I could start baking from home, I could be at home with my kids. I would not need to have a babysitter or put you guys in daycare. And that's why I decided to take some classes. And I went to um, Ames department store and they were offering Wilton cake decorating classes. They were four weeks in a row and I signed up for them and I went all by myself and there was three other people in class and I learned how to decorate. The real reason when I started this before, I had, in my mind I decided when Brian was two years old, his birthday, he wanted a Superman cake. And I went to Walmart, I ordered him a Superman cake. It was expensive and I looked at that cake and I thought, there's no reason I can't make that. All it was was red icing, blue icing, and like the Superman emblem in the middle. And I thought to myself, I could do that, and I could save us money. And that's why I decided to go take the classes. Oh, it's the best right now. Every year I do a little better. Every year the business increases because I am advertising uh, Facebook. Facebook is incredible because I get a lot of business on Facebook. I have my name on our van. Um, I have business cards. I have business cards that I use and word of mouth. Okay, the first four or five years that I started doing this, I showed a loss. So I didn't make anything. Matter of fact, we were in a hole <laughs> about $1,400 every year. But that's because it cost a lot to get started. I had to buy all the stuff, which I bought more than I needed, but I had to buy all the stuff and I didn't know how to charge for ingredients. But now, I think I probably contributed five or six thousand dollars a year. Which is not great, but it's not that bad. I'm just myself at home, you know? I don't have anybody working for me. I just do it all by myself, so. I have the same people ordering off me that have from the beginning. And also, I have our neighbor Margo's company in Donora and Bel Vernon. They order every month, and they've, every, or, every month they've ordered a birthday cake for all the people that celebrate a birthday, and small individual four inch round cakes for the office people who have birthdays. They're like my original followers, and that's been 15, well, yeah, 15 years. And I still do every single month I make for them. So that's what I call, they're very dedicated and they're very, you know, reliable. Oh, if I had the money, I would love to open up a bakery. Actually get out of my house and actually have a store, a storefront, and have all the baked goods in display when you walk in and have like wedding cakes in the windows for display. That's what I would love to do. In, for the whole month of November, I sell pumpkin rolls and chocolate rolls, and I donate a dollar to the food bank in town where we live in Shalori for every one I sell. So this is the third year in a row that I've done that. The main reason why I do Christina's Cakes, well, other than financially, I would say it gives me something to do that I enjoy. Um, I like I like doing it. It's a, it started out as a hobby and now it's like a business, but I like doing it and it keeps my mind busy because I tend to worry, <laughs> but it keeps my mind busy and it keeps me focused and I can think ahead like, okay, how am I going to decorate this, I don't know, Spongebob cake I have to make and then I can lay in bed and I can think and I can plan what colors I want, what I want to do, what size, what layer. I like doing it because it gives me things to think about and it gives me things to look forward to. And I like take a little pride when people like what I've given them. 
and they give like compliments on Facebook and they tell their friends to order off of me and I've like this Christmas I've had to ship cookies out of state which I've never done before but people have seen my pictures on Facebook and I sent them to Colorado and Virginia and North Dakota and I've never done that before yeah so I just like doing it but I it's also for the money